conversational content. If you talk to young people, they will actually, we got this from a young person, he's like, you know, when I'm on the commuter train, I'm looking through the newspapers and through the online stuff because I want to find out what are interesting things to talk about that I can talk to my friends about. Relationship isn't like, what are you going to do? So here am I, we're having a relationship. I stand here, she stands here, nothing happens. Okay? Relationship has to have content. What are you going to talk about? Conversational content turns out to be huge. I mean, why do you think everyone's watching, you know, it used to be lost and now it's idle this or, you know, whatever the that show is, and all of a sudden you have something to say, right? You have something to say. Actually, finding conversational content is non-trivial. What is my music that I'm telling you about? Oh, something to say. What is politics? Something to say. Okay, now what happens? Now go back to frequency. So I found the content, what do I do? I send, I, right? Oh, now I call, what do we say? Did you see what I sent, right? Let me talk now. So think about what cool tools are doing. They're giving you content that gives you something to do in the frequency of your content. And that's what's happening in the lives of people.